Morning. How you doing? This is where I'm picking up Spencer, Bethany Park. He's staying here right now with his family. All those hills up there I've hunted. That's actually where the mountain bike park is, but there's also pigs up there. You can see this young rooster here just coming. How you going? Good. Oh, I haven't seen you this year, have I? Uh, nah. Put it there. I can see you. I think you might have got bigger. Just we'll jump in, mate. We'll do it. This is Kai Teri Teri, folks. Golden sand. I grew up here. Well, in this part of the world, at least. My father was a ranger. National Park. We live in Tōtoranui that way. It feels like the wind's coming up, but we'll stick to the coastline. Pretty amazing place. And we're into it. Beautiful. Can go back in and see, mate, but well done. So, what you want to do there is drop your bail first, open your bail up. There you go, that's, that's the boy. Good man, got your bail open now. You can let a bit of string off and uh, a bit of line off, and you can deal with your fish rather than try to pull it. Good going. That tea towel I gave you, use that, mate. Wrap it around the fish, don't get a spike in you, and get him in the water as quickly as you can because he's a wee snapper that can get bigger for another day. Good going. 
The birdie's starting to bring in the wee ones, the big ones will follow hopefully. Nice going. Well, it might not seem like a big deal, but that's actually Spencer's first time ever catching a fish from a kayak. So it's the first. I've just given young Spencer a sabiki rig. We're going to go off that point straight out there. See if we can catch him a small fish because we're out of bait just about. Get these guys in. Junky jig can go like that. And a nice little lagoon. Gonna explore up in here, see what it looks like. Look at this. Coming on a wave. Magic. Just magic. The ocean shit is bountiful, but you take your life easily. Go steady. The ocean she is amazing I don't have complacency For many a fool has been I think that's what we're going to do is we're going to target yellow-eyed mullet with sabiki rig. Would you look at this place? It's just absolutely beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Wow. Amazing. Just like I just found paradise. Mm. This will be some nesting birds. Grey here and over there. This is what I love about the kayak. You come into places like this. I've never been here before. This is a little bit of heaven. Let's look at this fish here, look, right beside me. down and it's bringing in quite a few, mostly small but we might get a bigger one. Ah, loving this burly. Well, I've given the cradle to young Spencer for his fishing. Oh some nice big ones coming in there too. It's a little bit small and that is a yellow-eyed mullet. We're gonna put this guy back some bigger ones here. That's the bigger ones I want to eat. There you go, mate. And now I've caught a bigger one. That's what I wanted to catch. That's an edible size. Haven't got them in yet on the sabiki. Here we go. Oh, yes. Very, very rich in omega 3. Beautiful little fish. Nice eating fish. Oh, we've got another one on. Yeah, that's a bigger one. Awesome. That's the fish. That's the size I want to catch. 
Yes. I've just taken the guts out of my last one. Oh yeah, that's a good one. Nice yellow-eyed mother. Beautiful. Can catch bigger than that. In my position, because there's a young family that just started swimming where I was fishing, so I'll give them that space and I'll park up here. Burley's uh, bringing a few more small ones in, but I'm really looking for those bigger ones. Did you catch any snapper? I think we probably need to get going. I'd say that uh, we're going to get stuck from that tide otherwise. All right, let's go out of here. The storm it is over. I'm climbing out to say in my father's kayak to catch out fish for tea. That's the man, and paddle hard, get out. Don't stop paddling, keep your paddling going, otherwise you wipe out, keep going. Keep paddling. Paddle hard. That's the way, good man. Good man, it's very important you keep the power on when you're going out through waves like that. I see you're stopping there in the middle of it, you just end up getting wiped out. Got to use the momentum of going forward and always point up into the waves. It's quite choppy out here. You've got no control if you're stationary, you know. Oh, I'm heading away down to McKee Domain to meet Rangi Heri Heri. Oh, I need to get those bloody squeaky brakes fixed before. We start hunting this season. You don't want squeaky brakes in the forestry. You turn up and it tells every pig, we're here, fuck off. That's what's on the roof. I'm gonna take probably the yellow one, because I'm used to it, that's the Prowler 13, my dad's old kayak. Reports are there's bugger all fish out in the bay right now. My son was fishing last night with some crabs trying to catch some rig, and I haven't had a report back how he got on, but we'd like some rig. Rungy Heady Heady went out yesterday, and said all he caught was small stuff and took nothing home, so it sounds like the, uh, the big ones have gone back out to sea further. When I wake up in the morning, love, and the sunlight hurts my eyes, and something with a warning love. It's heavy on my mind Then I look at you And the world's alright with me Just wanna look at you And I know it's gonna be A lovely day Possible to face when 
to someone else instead of me Always seems to know the way Then I look at you And the world's alright with me Just one look at you And I know oh, it's it? gonna be A lovely yeah. day Just beautiful Shake just there. Oh, it was a good song. Someone else instead of me always seems to know the way. Then I look at you, and the world's alright with me. Just one look at you, and I know it's gonna be. <laughs> How you getting on, bro? Good, good. Are you out on the water now? Yeah, mate. I'm out here in front of you. Oh, yeah, because I, I turned around and I just seen a kayak on the beach and I was like, oh, shit, there might be some waiting. No, nah, no, nah, I'm not waiting, bro. I'm out here. I just, I just dropped the anchor. I'm not going to go any further because it's, the wind will come up in another round. We need another hour to get out to the zone. So, just going to, um, just going to fish in, in close here. So I'm not far from you right now. So that's you right in front of me. Yeah, in the yellow kayak. Yep. Oh yeah, because yeah, I, I seen the red one on your truck, and then I seen another one behind me. So I, that's why I sort of stopped. I was like, oh, should I better check my phone and make sure that is him? Yeah, the, the one that's behind you, he's another fella that slept in this morning too. Oh, yeah. oh sweet, I'll um, <laughs> see you in about a couple. Yeah, okay, see you, see you out here, mate. Hey, bro. 10 metres. 10 metres here? Yeah. Is that how deep it is? That's actually not bad. I thought it was only yeah, about six. Quite a lot of sign coming through. Oh, you get a fish finder on board, have you? Yep. <laughs> He's all flash in the North Island, eh? Yeah. Oh, okay. So did you stop on the way out for those fish, or? Yeah, I dropped the drink down. Little um, tungsten fleas. Oh, yep. They work, they tend to work really well. But nothing. Jeez, mate, it's a nice looking rig you got. Hell yeah. Same to you. Oh, she's pretty, pretty rough, but hey, it works. That's nice, you got a fish finder, shit. Yeah, it was a good package I bought off a mate who had heart problems when he was fishing. Oh, yeah? He'd fish on his kayak and he'd black out. Shit, that's not good. So he sold his kayak to me. Oh, okay. Poor bugger. What was his name? Uh, Ricky. He's, he's got back into it now. He just bought the kayak with the higher seats. Oh, okay. Good idea. And then he bought a Bixby motor. Oh, Bixby motor as you go, yeah. Yeah, yeah I've got a fucked shoulder, so I can't go too far. But I would have gone out another probably another hour, but by the time another hour goes by, the wind will be up and it's not much fun, so... And you can catch fish in here too. Yeah. Yeah, it wants the burlies. It takes about half an hour for the burlies to work. Is that like a pod in the back, is it? Yep, yep, that's just the same as your chilli bin. Except that's more insulated, this isn't. They, these warm up quite a bit. Oh, yeah? But you can still fit a power load of fish in them. Yeah, right, eh? How heavy is the boat? Uh, 24 kilos Oh, yeah? Loaded. Yeah, that's um, manageable. Oh, you got a trevally. Hey, get it on the boat, bro! Nice, hey, nice fish, bro. Fuck yeah, good going. Don't let it jump out, man. Those things are impossible to kill, too. Uh, I've got my finger in his gill because he's legal. 
Yeah, he's wiggling, he's coming home. Awesome, awesome. Yeah, bloody time too. G'day mate, not the biggest one. There's bigger ones down there. But I'll keep him. There's bigger ones than that, that's actually a small one compared to what's down there. About bloody time I'll hook one. He's got a bloody parasite in his mouth, mate. Is he? Gonna pull that, that out of his gob. He's not gonna give it up. Fuck, mate. It's breaking, but it's coming out. It's breaking. Got a big fucking parasite down his gob. Jeez, look at that. I pulled that out of his gob. Got little feet on it. It's in his mouth. No wonder he's not. So is the sea lice is he eating the sea lice or is the sea lice eating him? No, nah, they crawl in, they they pick it up and it grows on their tongue and it yep. eventually kills the tongue and replaces it. Oh yep. So there's no harm to the fish. Oh okay. Oh bro's got something big on. He's up to him. What do you reckon, bro? It's taking you for a merry ride! <laughs> He's got a good one! It's taking you back the other way! You keep your rod at the front of the boat! Oh, I'm trying to turn my kayak around! Yeah, keep your rod at the front, so it pulls you around, bro. It's a big one! What is that? Oh, you listen to that screaming! It's Woo! screaming, man! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> What have you hooked into? I reckon it's a kingy bro or a bloody big snapper. What do you reckon, big snapper? He's coming up to the top shark. A shark is it? No, 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 kingfish. Kingfish, oh yeah, beauty. Awesome, yeah it is too. Oh yeah, it's a kingfish, yeah I can see it. Awesome. Holy shit, bro, you gonna get that in the boat? <laughs> it's a beauty, all right? He's woken up. Rangi <laughs> Hiri Hiri's having a lot of fun today. Oh, bro. Been a long time since the king, he's been caught out here, mate. You haven't landed him yet. He's not on the boat yet, bro. Yeah, man, yeah, that's good. He's a fighting fish, too. Woohoo! Oh, he's giving it in. Is he giving it in? No, not oh, he's... Ah. What'd you hook him on, bro? Stray line, a uh, half of, um, a half of that piper. Oh, yeah, he's coming in there. Oh, it's a bit of caught on Piper. <laughs> oh, yes. Woo you going to land it? If I can get him up onto the surface and get my net underneath him. <laughs> oh, mate, too much, too much. Come on, bro, don't lose it. Thank God for circle hooks. Yeah, yeah. I'm trying to hold the phone steady. He's a powerful fish, bro. Oh he's, oh, he's fighting hard, eh? Nice! Oh, I hope he lands his fish. It's a good fight. It's a good battle. It's been going for a while now, bro. Oh, it's a good fish! That's a beauty! Mate! That's a stonga! Woohoo! <laughs> oh, holy shit! That's a big fish! <laughs> he smashed it! Oh, I'm so stoked for him! Wicked! Let's have a look at that bloody fish, bro! Bro, fuck, let's look at this! Awesome! Awesome! Beauty! <laughs> oh, man! Is it stuck? Did you ecky it? Oh, I've 
half my ikkid in, but I just have to unclip my line so I can... Um... Yeah, yeah. Oh, mate, that's a ripper. That's a ripper of a fish. Jeez, look at it. Bro. Oh, mate, that's a cracker. Far out. That's a beauty. They're out here. They're out here, bro. You beauty. Isn't that a ripper Ooh. fish? What a beautiful day on the water. Oh, mate, you're smashing it. That's awesome. I'm stoked for you. Doesn't get any better, bro. Doesn't get any better than that. That's a nice fish. See a bit sore, are you? Oh, shoulder was. Yeah, me too. Yeah. <laughs> This has probably been the best fishing I've had for 2021. It was just absolutely phenomenal morning. We got off to a late start, but it didn't make any difference because you didn't hook into that till about 1.30. Yeah. So, yeah, and we tried all morning with live baits, nothing, and persistence is what won the end of the day. But it wasn't only that, it was when Rangi Hedi Hedi caught it, he played it so well, he didn't like, you didn't go too hard, you played it. And that's the difference, because a lot of people hook into kingfish, but they don't necessarily land them. And to be honest, I didn't think you were going to land that, because that was a horse of a fish for <laughs> How much was the weight in there? 11.4 kilos, 25, just over 25 pounds. Just over 25 pounds. Holy shit, man. It was, it was awesome to see. So I don't know how the video's come out, because I haven't edited it yet, but um, fucking awesome, bro. Smashed it. Hey, you have a safe trip back to Wokotika? Thank you. And we'll do it again sometime? Yeah, surely will. Yeah? We'll be back again. Next Doesn't matter. <laughs> it's all good. Hey, thanks for watching, guys. Good luck, the own fishing, getting out there and doing it. And be good. Can't be good, then be careful because he was an extremely careful day and he uh, brought home the goodies. You gonna sashimi it? Yeah. Yum. Smoke the frame, smoke the yep. head. Smoke the frame, smoke the head, and sashimi the rest. Yeah, that was awesome.